Hello again, my EDF yesteryear Yorkshires. Welcome back to my Let's Play of EDF Insect Armageddon. Uh, let's see, I actually had an update for this game, believe it or not, today. I'm not sure what it would do, but it seemed like it was running fine so far. I'm on Xbox One here. So we're on Mission 5 here, the Daddy. So this was pretty cool, if I remember correctly. Definitely like this boss type. But I don't really remember much else of the level, except this huge... So I think we are on Jet Trooper now again. Um, so yeah, I'll select this one. And I have tier... what tier am I here, does it say? Oh, tier 3. Um, I have it on hard, but I don't know if hard is actually... if I'm strong enough for hard yet. I'm not sure. I do remember the, the daddy. You want something long range so you can actually shoot the the opening pretty good. Let's see, what does this thing do? Increase significant... what is this? Numerous shots increase significantly. A new energy s system maintain higher output, uh, something or other. Grenade. I do have snipers for this class. Does 381 a second, or just does 500 a second. And the reload time is 4 seconds. 8 shots. Uh, I could unlock this. Did I equip it now, though? Yeah, I did equip it, right? One thing that's confusing to me in this game is where you're selected. Like, right now, I'm assuming I'm selected on the lighter, the weapon that's lighter, that's lit up. But no, it's not. It's the darker, but then it starts flashing. So, I don't know. It's very it's a little bit confusing. I've always had that issue in this game. Uh, what else do we have? We have a rocket launcher. Do we have a new goat strike? I want something homing, I think. So this is a homing. Auto locks is faulty. What does that even mean? Uh, seeks base silicate based life forms and destroys them without whatever. One caveat: ravagers are carbon based. <laughs> That's funny. So it doesn't it doesn't lock on. Eight shots times a hundred. And then this one does turn rate of C. Three times fifty. Doesn't seem very strong, does it? And then this one, Plaxicore. They were kind of weird with their wording in this game again, where it's it's like, I would rather have it be more straightforward of what it does, and then jokes at the end. So this breaks into four, and then five, 56 damage times four, I'm assuming. And then here's the goat strike. Three times 47 times one a second. Uh, it doesn't seem very strong, does it? Uh, here's a rocket launcher. 200 a second. Salt rifle. What does this one do? This is a homing salt rifle. 57 damage times 6. That's 300 damage. Oh, a long reload time though. 5 second reload. So if it shoots 6 a second, then it would shoot... it would take 10 seconds to, th to, um, to fire this thing out. But that seems like that's decent damage. I'm going to take this thing. It's free, too. I don't have to buy it, so... Let me change my color. Um, whatever, that's fine. Okay. okay Alright, so area. is this thing... Roger. Oh, this is a sniper rifle. Okay, right-click oh, is a zoom. And, oh my goodness, a reload on that. Oh, I got it. Okay. And then... Here's the machine gun. Okay, well, we'll see if we're strong enough on hard. I don't know. Because... I don't know how hard this mission was. I may need, like, an actual... You know, since I have a sniper, I may actually need an explosive weapon because of the... It doesn't seem very strong either. I'm, I mean, I'm on hard. I just want to see if I want to continue with this. Oh, if you don't zoom in, it's not accurate. Interesting. You know what? I don't actually mind that. I think that's kind of a good idea. I don't know if I want to continue with this on hard, though. Did I actually take two shots to kill with the sniper? No, okay. It shouldn't be. 
Oh, as a whole, I'm I'm an idiot. Anyway, let's let's um let's quit a second because yeah, my class isn't strong enough for hard. But I will uh, continue with uh, I think with the weapons I have. All right, we'll, we'll do a normal because yeah, because I'm only rank three and I'm supposed to have up to rank five on normal. So yeah, I was I'm way too far. I, I was thinking my jet had better rank, but I, I didn't. They're being pulled out too. You need to rendezvous with them and secure the area before we can proceed with But the I think on normal that machine gun will be strong enough, so let's just ready up here. Okay, lightning. Move in and secure the area. And Roger. there's actually a hole here, so we can Come on, you dumb At least I think there is. No, there's there's no hole here that I see. Huh. Ooh, look at that. That's so cool, I love that. Wait a minute, did they actually make my I reload easier on normal? Do you see that? I didn't know that was a thing. No, I guess, I guess, I don't know, because this one's not easier. Yeah, this feels a lot better on normal. I should have, uh, I should have known that I can't play on hard yet on this class. Area is secure, Lightning. New waypoint is set. You yeah, it's a head for bit faster. <laughs> Might as well get all this overshield. Alright, and then this is... Look at their dash. Doesn't even seem like it's worth it for this class. Oh, okay, good. I do have a homing for the drones. That's gonna be nice. Lightning. This is bad. You know that giant ravager we were rooting you away from? Oh yeah, there it is. Yeah, it's such a cool boss. It's a little creepy to me because of just how large it is and, and just long legs have always been something that messes with me in the head. So, I think it's... Shoot it in the booty. Oh yeah, there's a vehicle over here too I can use. Looks like it's just one shot to kill a drone with this machine gun. Oh, we got drones. Okay. Or not drones, but we have uh, dropship. I should be able to take out that, no problem, with this sniper. So jet can fly, and they can also get the sniper rifle. So that's not really a benefit of the. It's not really a benefit of the ranger only. I feel a little cheated here. I kind of like these drones idea, don't you? Like it, 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 they, they shoot, or they can dive bomb you, which is kind of unique. It's like a unique, uh, different attacks. Oh yeah! Oh my goodness! Yeah, that sniper's Go ahead, good. Intel. We're calling this thing the Daddy Long Legs for obvious reasons. Uh, forgive me, this is. Right, where's that thing gonna drop it? Okay. It's Just making sure. I've died to that. Laser. Okay, got it. Much like the carrier, the spawning bay is unshielded when open. Focus your fire there. Lightning, did you copy that? Copy Focus that. Fire on the spawn hole. The hold spawn on. hole. I can do this. Another drone, though. Another dropship. See, can I shoot this? Looks like I can sh do damage to it. So I'm just going to shoot the booty. I don't know. I want to test this because I've I, I I probably tested this in the past. I just don't remember. I want to know for the future. Um. Oh my goodness! It's a lot of dudes now. Oh, did I hear Hector's? I think I hear Hector's. You know, I'm using this vehicle because why not? You know, this thing is this thing is legit. I hear Hector's, yeah, where are you? I 
kind of want to use it to kill the Hector. I remember those lasers from the bottom of the Daddy Long Legs being pretty nasty. I thought maybe oh okay the dropship disappears. Okay, it doesn't stay there. I vaguely remember that now. Okay, let's just work on killing Mr. Uh, Mr. Leggy. That's the best I got. He needs to quit moving, you know, first thing. Show some respect. Oh, we got wasps. Great. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm, I must have did a certain number of damage to it. I'm just gonna use this thing to kill the wasps. Those are more of a threat. Where are you? Oh, there's a Hector. Okay, I thought I heard him roaring in the background. He looks so tiny. I don't think there's three different sizes. I think there's just the uh, two, two sizes. Of course my controller batteries are low. Of course they are. You know what? Because I literally only have one USB port available right now, and I'm using it for my capture card. So of course every time I, control I uh, do this, it's going to be low. Um, hmm. How am I going to charge this? Maybe it'll last. Maybe my batteries will last. The thing is, it's not going to last. Hold on a second. Let me... F there has to be a charge in the back here. Um, I have a, I have two hard drives now hooked up to my um, Xbox. So, that's a thing. So, I need to use my PlayStation, maybe, to charge my Xbox. Oh, wait a minute. Here we go. I'm so sorry. These things always happen. Maybe my Samsung tablet can charge my controller. Let's find out. Plug this in here and this into here. Is this gonna work? Oh, okay, it does work. Nice. Okay. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Alright. Well, now I know I can use my tablet charger to do this. Probably gonna destroy my battery, but whatever. These are generic off brand batteries I bought. Two for ten dollars or something. Oh, he dropped a weapon. Let me get this weapon. Uh, where are you? Hot foot. Alright, do I have a sniper? I do. Look at the sound of that sniper. Wow, that's 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 terrible sound design, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Oh what? Oh my goodness! What? I killed it already? Wow. Okay. See, like normal's too easy, but hard is too hard. So I'm like in the perfect spot where where I need to like play on hard, I guess, and just suffer through it. I also remembered for each class, so it was a problem. Can I keep taking this? No, I can't. I don't think that's the end. Oh, it is the end. Wow, okay. Um, items found. Nothing. Well, let's do the next mission. Yeah, I'm on I'm on chapter 2. So let's Let's do the next mission, I guess. And I'm, I guess I'll just switch it to hard. Your assignment is to get in there and check out all of the crash sites. Because it's such a cool, such a cool thing. Let me go back now and quit, and then select it on hard here. I mean, since I can fly, it's not gonna be as big of a deal. Because that was that was a little bit too easy. It says for veterans, though. I don't know. Chapter two. Industry. Chapter two, one. Yeah. Oh, this is a cool boss, too. This is the first time you see, I think, the large Hector. I'm not sure. I'm going to take that sniper then again, I think. Um, yeah, because I'm still tier 4. Or tier 3, rather. But I'm going to need something... Oh, there's metal spiders, I think, in this one. 
regrouping some of them are salvageable. If any of the pilots survived, we'll need you to get them out Faulty. of the You can expect this to be as so this is 100 times far. 8, so it shoots all 8 Spotted shots. Town is being hit hard. It's starting to look more like old Detroit. Beta squad will What's be the blast on that thing? One. 10 meter blast? Oh, I just want to try this weapon to see what it is. It okay, seems lightning. crazy. Up for the first crash site. Oh, okay, it doesn't shoot them like a V pattern. It just shoots them all, all in one shot. Not bad, right? Looks like you have ravages inbound. Take them out before proceeding. Okay, this isn't the big Hector yet. I mean, see, the, the sound in this weapon sounds so good, but the sound on the sniper sounds so bad, it's like it's a mixed bag, you know? It's, it's kind of disappointing. I should probably fly more, right? I mean, I can fly, after all. As, oh my goodness, you can't stop shooting that thing once you shoot it, so... I should be using this tank, what am I doing in my life? This thing is always legit, because it always one-shots, and they get in. They actually get into the turrets, and this is cool on this one. And they're actually pretty good with the turrets, so... The first EDF that the, the NPCs drive... Yeah, I remember using this to kill the carriers. Which is, it's never being pretty strong on this carrier, so you might as well use it now. And there's always one open, it seems like, as they both close. And these guys will help protect me a little bit. I think the tanks, yeah, the tanks drive, I think, pretty good in this game. Oh, I'm on hard, too, I have to remember this. Um. Probably should be moving instead of just staying in one spot, but it's hard to look and look up and. Oh my goodness! Why am I driving? They should drive. They're better drivers of it. Let me get back out of this hole. I know I can't see, but I can see. I promise. This vehicle's about to go. I'm trying to move. I thought the vehicle controls were better. Okay, rip. That wasn't very good. <coughs> Well, let's see if we can do this. These drones suck. <coughs> I'm gonna like to run away a little bit here. Are my guys dead? They are not. No retreat, no surrender, soldier! Alright, can I kill these enemies with my weapon? Sorry, old man, I, 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 I know I, I hit you there. You're kind of slidey with this character. It's not bad, it's just different. Oh no, the red, the red border. Not the red border. This does 800 damage. I think. Problem it's not accurate though. It's always a good time to take a new weapon that you don't know if it's any good when you're fighting on hard first time. Alright. Let's get ready for this. I imagine this still should be strong, though. I'm not really fighting the enemies, though. <laughs> they still open, though, at least, so that's good. It's gonna be fun killing drones with this with this weapon, I think. I can't remember this mission for the life of me, though. I'm trying to think of what's coming next, and I don't know. I want to say there's nests or something. I don't know.
Seems strong enough. Okay, that's good. I'm trying to keep moving though the whole time. I don't want to stand still. Oh my goodness. I need some health. So do they. You get quite a bit of health from those health packs as I lose my health. So good. I'm getting destroyed by something. What in the world is destroying me? You do get more health when you up when you level up though, I mean, so maybe that's part of the thing. At least I can kill these in one shot still. My goodness, these drones hurt so much. Maybe I should kill the drones. I thought that they keep spawning out of the ships. Alright, let's... We need to work on this thing too, though, too. It's This has left me more intense. I just feel like it's a war of nutrition and I'm losing because of the... Because of these drones. Yep, they do spawn drones, so I, there's really no point in killing these drones, it seems. That's, I guess that's why, you know, like, there's five difficulties in the in the main game, but... There's only three in this one, so it's harder to ease into the difficulties, because you only have three options. Instead of, like, switching to hardest or something. Oh, I overheated. You can still sprint, though, which is weird. Where's his health at? It's like my last health. Alright, come on, just go down. One ship down would be nice. I'm just doing no damage to these enemies. Or to the dropships, I mean. I don't know if I can play on hard. As much as how easy normal is. I mean, I haven't even got a ship down to dark color. Look at all these enemies on the screen still, too. And I know this isn't the end, so... I think I'm just gonna be. I think I'm just gonna be dead here if I just continue this. Yeah, much as I don't want to do this, I can't play this on hard. <laughs> That's so lame. Like you saw how easy normal was, but yet yeah, hard is, you know, taking those ships down is just not gonna happen. At least not in any relative short amount of time. So I guess we do have to do normal. It's too bad. Lightning. A squadron of landers went down in this, this industrial area. This be a huge area. difference. Your assignment is to get in there and check out all of the crash sites. Comnet has been disrupted. All right. And well, to any of the I don't know if I like this rocket launcher. You have to manually activate the transponders so we can run down. Let's just take the goat strike. We need every lander we have left at this point. So we all right. Okay, lightning. I have a waypoint. I remember the ghost strike being good, but it just. Proceed with caution. Oh, it shoots three per burst. Okay, that's good. So it doesn't like. Two shots, you have to reload or anything like that. Look at those vehicles just flying by, it's so cool. I remember taking out the ships with these with with these tanks. Yeah, I did that. Correction, we have two. You can drive the machine guns too if you want to get into the side as well. I know the tanks scale for, for difficulty though, so it's not like, you know, it would have been any faster because it's normal. I think the tanks are just scaled.
I mean, the enemies do go flying, I guess, in this game, but they don't. It's not like EDF, the main line. Explosion's not very big on this thing, though, that's for sure. My goodness. This is like the Halo tank, how it drives, where you, whatever way you're, oh my goodness, what? What? I have never seen that. Maybe the update added that. I've never seen that before in this game. Alright. I want to kill a dropship with this vehicle. There we go. Okay, we're out. No, that's fine. Where am I? Where am I? Oh my goodness. What did this sh Oh my goodness, did you see that? <laughs> I was trying to find myself, and that ship landed right next to me. Wow, I almost died from that. I believe if it lands on you, you're dead. I'm pretty sure of that. Ooh, two squad mates down. How do I revive again? Okay, why? Not bad. Maybe normal is hard enough, I don't know. It just seemed like a fast for that daddy long legs. Because it says you get ra up to rank 5 weapons in this on, on normal, so... And I'm rank 3. So I'm, I still have room to grow in there. If I would have got the reload, I would have got it. Don't mention food. I haven't eaten my one meal for the day yet. I'm hungry a little bit. Alright. Yep, one shot left. What did that say? Oh, I thought it said something besides taxi. Transponder. All right. Yeah, this was the problem. Like a lot of the missions were just go to the transponder. I mean, it still were. I still think their missions are better than Iron Rain, but. I have to do it again. You have to do it twice. Activate the self-destruct sequence and attract a pulse, lightning. Lightning, get to that waypoint. You can still hit him anywhere you want with the sniper, but it does do more damage in his chest, I believe. Goodness. Yeah, I wouldn't have made this on hard, I don't think. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's one thing about, for me, for active reload, is with the bar, you know? <clears throat> it's one, it always... It's like a thing that it's like reminds you of how either how bad you did or how good you did. And it's just like a constant... You, know, you feel like you failed or you feel like you succeeded. I don't like that. I like... I don't like when I have to think about that every time I reload. Plus it makes me not focus about the actions quite as much. I'm focusing on the little bar instead. Because you, you, cause some weapons you reload all the time, you know? I don't know. I know I know a lot of people like it, but I, I just don't like it, personally. 
I don't mind it on Iron Raid which is some weapons have it though. Because it's not like every weapon, it's more like a perk rather than a every weapon has to you have to worry about this bar. They used to penalize you, I don't know if you remember that, but they they updated the game after it came out where first if you missed that bar, then it would it would make it longer, the reload longer than normal. Whereas now, or they eventually patch it to where if you miss it, it, it doesn't make the reload any longer. You don't penalize you for it, it's just you could have a chance of having half the speed, which definitely I like better. Alright. Let's head over to the thing now, because I think it... Might as well do it now. I want to get a nice big explosion explosion weapon for the jet core so I can fly really high and rain down destruction. Lightning, destroy all ravages and keep those crew members alive. EDF needs them. Are they gonna stay alive though? I don't think they're gonna stay alive. I like how there's a lot of like I don't know, little, little pieces of equipment and stuff on the road that can blow up and make make the explosions more spectacular. I think it they did a good job with that on here in this game. Yeah, this thing's kinda kinda weak. But I know there's a good goat strike. There's good that's one of the better weapons they have. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's right, you, when you reload your weapon, I forgot when you reload you actually use energy as well. I was wondering why your energy gets dropped quite a bit, so... Yeah, they don't want you to fly very much in this game, it seems. I'm trying to get this health, I promise. Seems like when you get um, when you get hit, it interrupts your aim, which I guess it should make it makes sense. But oh my goodness! I don't remember this mission quite honestly. I don't remember what's coming up next. Is there is it a praying mantis? Next? I don't know. We'll see. Those could those jump too really high? I didn't remember that. Just like Iron Rain. Lightning. Unknown ravager approach. Left click. Intel, you see? Oh my goodness. Okay, this is the first time you see these spiders. Little tick spiders. I, I can't imagine them like making this game and they're like, you know, I need you to make a sound for this sniper rifle and then they make the sound they're like and they listen to it and they're like, yep, that's it, ship it. I just don't understand the sound, it sounds so bad. See, like, I was able to kill that spider in, like, you know, four magazines or something. I mean, it is a sniper, but still. It's a little too easy, but then hard is... I don't know. I'll be ranking up here maybe soon. Ooh, weapon. New? Nothing new. Alright. Upgrades. Am I a next rank? No. Not even close. Items found. Nothing new. All right, so we will. So we did two missions, and we'll be on predation here. Lightning. I have the coordinates on the second crash site. Well, we got to see two uh, two bosses. I, 
I mean, it wasn't, if it wasn't for the uh, survival mode, um, I wouldn't. We wouldn't have seen that boom spider before. But, but yeah, that's that's the next big enemy they introduce, which has a bunch of little ticks and kind of keeps spawning those ticks where you have to tap the Y button. But um, but yeah, I guess I'll end that here. So so yeah, once again, thanks a lot for watching, and hope to see you on the next one. And remember, Eve doesn't leave a man behind, ever. And for interested in ways to support the channel, please consider hitting the join button, which is next to the subscribe button, or watching a few ads or sharing your channel with someone that does help financially. It's very much appreciated. Thanks a lot.